up YouTube? This is your boy Wolf Rock, aka Ollie the Rock. This video will be going on both channels because I'm very excited. I got home from work and I'm like, I was waiting to watch this video with you guys because it's kind of one of those things where I like to do uh, new covers from a people that I really, really enjoy and I want to do it with you guys as a first look. Um, for some of you guys that know, I'm a metal fan, and also I have another channel called Ollie the Rock. Because I'm posting it on both channels, I'll be addressing both of you guys at the same time. So, Flori Jensen has released a cover, yes she did, of the song from Heart called Alone. Um, now, if you guys don't know Heart, for you guys that are rockers, you guys will know, well, they do some ballads too, but... Um, a lot of the heart music I really love. Uh, I've always enjoyed heart ever, ever since I got to know heart, so I know heart quite well. Um, this song specifically is kind of an interesting song because when um, when this song first came out, it had when you look at the lyrics itself, it really gives you a sense of what the person singing is actually feeling in that moment, and you can almost relate to. It to a certain degree. So I have some notes that I made from geez, several years ago uh, when it came to the song that I actually wrote down. It was my personal notes. I actually copied it over to my um, uh, copier printer that actually saves all my important documents that has to do with music into my computer, which is kind of cool. Um, but this one here, this is what I said originally. Uh, this is to me now. This is not anybody else. This is just my thoughts of what I see in the lyrics. So um, this song, is, I really feel like it's talking typically um, uh, about a single person um, that has fallen for someone else, um, whoever that person might be. Where in the, in the lyric it says, till now I've always got my by on my own. I never really cared until I met you. So... You know, some, uh, it's a single person that has fallen. Who knows? It could be a married person. That's <laughs> Let's hope that's not the case. But let's say it was a single person that has uh, fallen for someone that, that they met, whoever that someone might be. Um, but they don't know how to approach the person at all. They have no clue how to approach that person. I know that when I was younger and didn't know a lot about relationship, I still don't to this day, but... Um, you have a hard time approaching someone that you you're falling in love with in some sense. Maybe this person has known that person for a while, so it's kind of an interesting thing. And then I put on here it says, um, "How do I get uh, you alone?" Maybe to get that person to express how they feel towards that other person. And and then it continues on, but then this, uh, but the secret is still on my own. My love for you is still unknown. But I think. The person is falling for uh, someone, but in a very slow way and not very fast. And then uh, the lyric that says, you don't know how long uh, I have wanted to touch your lips and hold you tight. Eventually, I think, uh, the person is uh, singing the song to uh, singing the song, decides to tell the, uh, the other person how they feel. They made a decision to go tell them. And then it goes back again on the verse. It says, you don't know how long I have waited. And I was going to tell you tonight. But what happens? Somehow they that person never got a chance to do it. So I feel that's where the song's at. It's like a lost opportunity to share your love with someone. There's a lot of expression, a lot of emotion in this song. The reason I'm telling you guys this before we listen to Floor sing this it's not just a song that you just need to listen to. You have to understand what this, the song is really about. I can go through the lyrics and and, uh, and go uh, lyric by lyric how I see it. But when you put that into context and then you listen to the song, I think it comes together and it just it makes the song more impactful, if that makes any sense. I don't know. That's just my two cents. You know how I feel about my two cents. <laughs> All right, let's go to it. Let's do this. All right, let me let's get to the screen, floor, and here we go. Display, boom. Let's do this. Three, two, one, and go. Oh, 
hold on a second. Let me adjust the volume a little bit. I feel like the volume is just a little too low. I don't like it. I don't like it. So let's uh, let's adjust that to this and see if that works a little bit better. All right, let's go back a little bit. Oh, that's better. I hear the ticking of the clock. I'm lying here. The room's pitch dark. Okay. <laughs> All right, already, already, okay, I love Floor, don't get me wrong, she's amazing, amazing uh, singer, and she just even does it one more step higher when she puts the emotion already into the song. You can see, look at her face expression already. I think this is going to be really cool. By the way, no, no change of subject, but I really love her shirt. You know how I feel about wolves. <laughs> She wore it just for me. <laughs> well, maybe. All right, here we go. <laughs> I wonder where you are tonight. No answer on the telephone. And the night goes by so very slow. So beautiful, so beautiful. Okay, so the reason I'm stopping it because it is a cover song and I always worry about copyright issues, so that's the reason why I stop it. She also has, is that a pendant that's a, a wolf too? Anyway, sorry. Um, so a couple of things right off the bat. Now, I know Hart's version quite well. And to see her singing like this in a very cozy, in a chair, really, um, really emotional to the song, really tied into what the lyrics are saying, that's something that she's, that's a gifted artist, if you don't know that. There's a lot of artists out there that can do that can't do that effectively. Um, like for example, Dimash is a great individual that can actually produce emotion while he sings. Floor is another one. Um, I got about ten or twelve people in my head that I can think of right on the top of my head that are very emotional singers through the way their tones and how they express themselves through their face and uh, their body language. You can tell a lot about a person by their body language. So I just think this is just fabulous. Sorry, I don't mean to stop it, but it's important to get through the whole thing. And now it me to the See, even in that lyric, you know, I was going to tell you tonight, that's kind of, I really feel that's someone that's really, really wanting to tell somebody they're, they're, that they love them, but just, just is not able to, whatever reason that they have that they are not able to do it. And man, Floor is killing it. I love this cover. She's doing such a great job of it. I'm sure that if... Uh, if they saw this cover, they would say, wow, this was well done. Well done so far. Man, such a beautiful lady too. So it just amazes me 
how well she sings. Just a beautiful lady. Just but the secret is still my own. And my love for you is still. Hold on a second. I gotta go back. Gotta go back. Well done. Yep. Wow. Hold on a second. Let me take this off here. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. Um, I'm going to have to re-listen to it again because once was just not enough. I'm going to have to do it a couple times. So two things, a couple, actually three things that I want to, I want to point out right off the bat. Well, question actually on number one is who's playing the piano? I wonder if it's Tomas. You never know. I'm just curious. You never know. I wonder who's playing the piano. Well done. Kudos to the piano. <laughs> Whoever that was. I was just pretty awesome. Let me see. Wait, does it say under video? Hold on a second. Let me look at the video real quick. Hold on. Uh, who's playing the piano? Uh, does it say anything about the piano? Lyrics? Yeah, there's the lyrics. Nope. Doesn't say anything about who's playing the piano. That would be nice to know. Music by... Oh, oh, no, it doesn't say. I thought it was, it's just a blank. It says music by JVDB. Jo, is it that, uh, JVBD Van, Van Dean Brook, I think it is. I, I'll have to double check. Anyway, I don't know who's playing, but very cool. Good job on the piano. Number two, Floor. Didn't quite do it the same as the heart, as far as the the whole song, as far as how it sounds. But the way she did it was well, well done. It, it was very, um, it, it felt very touching and very emotional. She definitely put the emotion that the song deserves. And that's something that I really, really appreciate about Floor. Every single song that I've seen her in Nightwish 
and every other from revamp to the other one. Even with revamp, uh, you could see even the emotion when she sings in the song. Really puts a hundred percent into the song. I don't believe you can do hundred and ten or hundred and fifteen. There's no such thing. You can give a hundred percent of yourself to a song. And most artists don't give themselves 100%. So it's really pleasure. It's awesome to see Floor do that in every musical piece. Brings joy to my heart. As soon as I, she started singing, I just got like, you know, emotionally tied to her as a singer because I do, do love her. She is an amazing, amazing human being and artist as far as what she's doing. Now, I talked to you guys last time on the last cover that I told you guys. A lot of these artists are taking the time to do these kind of things, A, because of the COVID situation, but B, also keeps their voice, their tool um, in practice. If you don't keep this in, in your muscle or this tool that you're using on to uh, make music, if you don't keep that going, um, you tend to lose some of your sharpness and some of your power that you have in your voice. Now, I'm not a voice teacher, I'm not another that, but I do believe that. This is what I've been told. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I really believe that a lot of these artists are doing these covers and stuff like that because they're trying to stay in tune. I want her to be on her best when they come back out with Nightwish and uh, knock it out of the park and get back into concerts. I cannot wait for that to happen again. Oh my God, I had, I had tickets, okay? I had tickets. Didn't get a chance to use them. Thank you, COVID. <laughs> anyway, all right. You guys are the best. I'll catch you guys later. Uh, it's always been a fun, fun time whenever I listen to Floor. I'm going to go, as soon as I'm done with you guys, I'm going to go listen to it a couple more times. Maybe playing it in the background for a little while. Um, as always, thank you so much. Let me put the little thing up here. Thank you for some watching. And if you want to subscribe, there's a little dog right here. I try to post as much as I can. And this on Wolf Rock, I post it a lot more than I do on Ollie the Rock. Uh, because I've had some issues with copyright issues over on Ali the Rock a lot more. So I tried to balance it out by putting one or two videos um, a week on the other one or even just one. This one I do a couple a week, sometimes three. But you can always watch them uh, on either one. It doesn't matter. This one is going to be on both of them. So, all right, guys. Catch you guys later. And as always, on Ali the Rock, I say stay metal. On this one, I say stay classic. But above all, stay safe. That's the biggest thing. Protect your family, your loved ones, and those that are around you. Don't forget to put a face mask on and do social distancing. Whatever it does to help yourself to stay protected. Love you guys. We'll catch you guys next time. And stay classic and stay metal.